channel. Today I thought that I would review a product that I just bought for you guys before I used it. And that is this Revlon. Am I holding it up right? Wrong way. That is this Revlon Salon One Step Hair Dryer and Styler. So we're gonna use it. I just got out of the shower, haven't brushed my hair yet. That's why I look like this. I thought I would just film the first time I used it so you guys could see my genuine reaction or opinion of it. So I think that like the whole point of this thing, I need a pair of scissors. The whole point of this hair dryer is that is so you don't have to brush your hair with one hand and blow dry it with the other. So I thought that that would be perfect for me because I was looking for a blow dryer. And then I stumbled upon like hot brushes and I saw this and it actually like blows air out of it while you're brushing your hair. Um, I read the reviews, they were mostly good. This is not sponsored by the way. Uh, I bought this on Ulta's website and it just got here today. The only negative thing about it was people said it was kind of heavy but like blow dryers are heavy too so I don't know that handle doesn't necessarily look like the most ergonomic handle but we shall see once i get this bad boy open that's so funny it says lightweight ergonomic design for maximum maximum comfort that was like the two things the only two things that i said about it was that i i read that it was heavy and it didn't seem like it was ergonomic and that's literally what it says on the box so let's just put this bad boy to test that's all that came in the box What's this? Where's the side that like opens? Oh, okay, it doesn't have one. Okay. Just take a whack at it. I'm not in my bathroom because um, I just get really nervous having my camera in the bathroom. I just feel like something's gonna happen to it because I've don't have a lot of counter space in my bathroom. So I'm doing it in my office. Okay, guys. It's large. It's very big. It's my first my first observation but it is ergonomic like it does feel good to hold but it just is like an awkward grip size for a hairbrush it's like <laughs> feels really big um so yeah standard length cord the bristle this is the kind of hairbrush that i like to use so i'm gonna plug it in some of you guys are probably curious how i blow dry my hair now and um right now i just use like a standard blow dryer but it's just like old and broken i have to like literally slam it on the counter to get it to turn on but i'll just like blow dry my hair like this and then i'll like set the blow dryer down brush my hair and then keep blow drying so i figured that this would be um better for me so we're gonna give it a go now if i can figure out how to turn it on oh there it is so the settings are right here at the bottom and it does have a cool setting, which I didn't know. So that's kind of neat. Let's try, start her off on low. Oh, that was anticlimactic. Let's try resetting. Aha. Cool. I need to crank it up a little bit.
fun, but I'm really, I'm honestly, this should be sponsored. This thing is dope. My hair is almost completely dry and my camera says I've been recording for eight minutes and that's like including my introduction. So like it's gotta be in under five minutes. It took me like three minutes at least to freaking get the thing out of the packaging. Hashtag one hand problems. I didn't even bring a hairbrush in here because like I wanted to really put this thing to the test. Like it is a blow drying hairbrush, so I shouldn't need a hairbrush, right? But like, it's like a good hairbrush. And I'm pulling the hair through like this, like it's actually detangling it. And I feel like it's, it's drying my hair really well and less frizzy than a blow dryer would. So let's continue, shall we? Okay guys, I wanna say, um, I honestly think that my hair, this is really gross, but might be a little greasy because I don't think that I rinsed my conditioner out well enough. But I would just, so I think that this is dry. It just like looks kinda wet because it's greasy, which is gross, so sorry, but it's just life, okay? But like, this thing just dried my hair in like five minutes. I'm impressed. I think it was like $50. Um. How much was it? You guys, I would definitely buy this. And my hair, I had no product in it. Like, it feels so smooth and not as dry as it does when I blow dry it with a normal blow dryer. So, I would like 10 out of 10 recommend this product to you guys. The Revlon Pro Collection One Step Hair Dryer and Styler. I'm gonna have some fun with this less heat related damage like it actually does feel like there is less heat related damage sweet all right guys well this is the finished product i normally have to run a flat iron through my hair to get this look so i'm really happy with this purchase i will link it in the description if you guys want to check it out and buy it but honestly like this was not a sponsored video i bought this because i needed a blow dryer and I wanted to mix it up. If you want to see more videos like this, let me know in the comments. I'm totally down to make more and buy more things. <laughs> Hopefully, eventually, I won't have to buy this stuff. That's the goal, right? Don't forget to subscribe. And if you want to get notified every time I make a video, don't forget to turn on the little bell that's right next to the subscribe button so you'll get a notification every time I post. Thanks so much for watching, guys, and I will see you in my next video.